watching K Gun 9 on your side. News at 6. Well, it looks like drivers didn't waste any time pouring on the speed just as soon as Pima County pulled the plugs on its speed enforcement cameras. But it seems the county didn't pull all of the plugs, so there is hard data that shows how hard drivers stomped on the gas. KGA 9 on your side's Craig Smith is live at one of the former camera sites with an explanation. Craig. First of all, we want to assure you that the camera contractor assures us that nothing is going on with this system that could lead to you getting a ticket. He says the cameras are down. However, there are still speed sensors set in the pavement, and for the next couple of weeks, they are still going to be reporting anonymous speed data anytime someone rolls through them at 11 over the speed limit or even faster. So, and we do hear that a lot of drivers are going a lot faster, so we pulled out the Speedbusters radar to have a look for ourselves. When the cameras shut down, it seems more drivers took off. Camera contractor American Traffic System says from January 7th to the 19th, two years ago, about 1,500 cars tripped the sensors by driving through at 11 over the limit. The number dropped to about 1,200 for the same period last year. But as of January 7th this year, the day after the camera shut off, the number of speeders jumped four and a half times the number for the same period the year before. What they say that when the cat's away, the mice are going to play. <laughs> Drivers like Javier Ramos say the cameras only had a temporary effect anyway. Do people actually slow down? Yeah, while they go through the camera, and then afterwards they speed back up. But some drivers say the speeds they see are just creeping up a little. So we brought the KGON 9 Speedbusters radar to a camera site on West Valencia. 45 is the speed limit here. Our radar zapping found some drivers zipping above the limit, but not the 11 over that would have set the camera flashing. At 51, no, down to 45. Dump truck, 41. And drivers know the cameras are not the only reason to behave themselves. You said you saw somebody writing a ticket right near yeah. this? <laughs> right on uh, mission, just as I turned the corner. Now, Pima County supervisors did say they do want the Sheriff's Department to develop a more finely focused, more comprehensive countywide speed enforcement system. Now, the supervisors are off for the Martin Luther King holiday today, so uh, we still have not had a chance to tell to find out from them just what they make of this data. Reporting live, Craig Smith, KGON 9 on your side. Craig, thank you. It'll be interesting to see what they think. Thank you.